Hi guys, welcome to another speed build video here on my channel. It is actually the first uh, speed bat build that we are going to be doing. However, what we are going to do today is build our little Elkapi habitat. So what we're going to start off doing here is just getting our glass uh, double one-sided uh, one-sided glass and we're going to kind of make it into almost like a U shape and then we are going to turn it and we are going to turn it around. I know that I couldn't could have used regular glass and saved a bunch of money, but I decided that I didn't want to because one, it's unlimited because this we're here on sandbox. And uh two, like, I don't know, oak appear shy. So they'll probably prefer it anyways. So we're gonna just connect up the barrier. Except we have to flip flip that. There's a little quick trick if you don't know how to do that. Oh, looks like we might switch it out. Nope, nope, we're just rising it up a lot, it looks like. Which I will have to fix in the future, because that was actually not, or was too big. So we're just going to try and make the path now. And please comment down below what type of speed builds you would like um, to watch in the future. Um, I could do anything, but remember, still not super I'm still pretty new to Plant Zoo, so sorry if they aren't great yet, but hopefully with your guys' support, it'll get better. So yeah, feel free to leave Plant Zoo tips or um, tricks or anything like that. Now, we are currently building a raised path. path. If you guys don't know how to build a raised path, all, path, or, yeah, path all you have to do is use um, J and U keys on your keyboard to make... Um, it go up and I think there's probably I think there's a setting you can do to make it so there's no pulls underneath but I like it better with pulls personally because I play Planet Zoo for the realistic part so let's see what we're gonna do next looks like we're gonna start trying to get rocks warning this bit is um let's just say it takes a while to get enough rocks so um if you don't want to see me placing a bunch of different types of rocks in lots of different places, uh, maybe skip ahead another minute or two. Or, um, yeah. Because it might uh, end up being a minute. I know that we are going to copy and paste some of these rocks. If you guys don't know how to copy and paste the rocks, what you can use is the little multi-select tool at the bottom right-hand corner. You can also use the I key to open it. And all you're going to do is push I, and then you are going to make it um, the select, and then you kind of like click and drag to get the area you want to select. And then you can, um, like, the thing will pop up, and it'll ask you what you want to do with it, and you just want to push duplicate. So that's how I do that, like you can see right now. Duplicate. I don't think I did that right, but we're going to redo that. Looks like it didn't save. Uh, or maybe I'm doing it different. I guess I decided not to do that for right there. Which I know that I have did do that at least later on since I didn't end up doing it right there though. So we're probably going to place rocks for another minute or two. If you still want to skip, you can. If you're still here, uh, well, I'm glad you like rock placing or maybe this is how far you skipped to so yeah some news about the channel so we are doing pretty well well we've only had this channel for what a couple months now and i believe we are at 16 subscribers and over the past 28 days plus four subscribers like 519 watch minutes and and, um, like, 159 views, which is really nice, but I would really enjoy to get it up. I know some people want that so they can make money, which would be fun, but the reason I do YouTube is for the social part of it. I like making videos that people can watch and enjoy, so, um, yeah, I would really, uh, love to know if you guys like it, and I would really um, love if you got your family and your friends to subscribe. It just shows me that you enjoy the content. And um, it's just, 
motivation for me to keep doing it. So, yeah, I really hope you enjoy. And, yeah, I am i don't... Did I not... What did I do there? Um, I don't think... Am I going to delete those rocks? I better delete those rocks. Hmm. Well, I don't know. I guess we'll have to find out what happens. So, what are we going to do now? Maybe... Yeah, we're going to go get ourselves some okapies after we caught some two healthy peacocks there for my other ones. We're going to get these silver levels, I believe. A male and a female, of course, so that way we can have some babies if we want to. And just place the door right around there, and then we're going to connect our path over to make it small and connect it to the main path so our keepers... And vets and mechanics can get over there if anything is to happen. And so they can put the animals in, of course, and feed them and stuff. Now, we got those two. We're going to move those two peacocks into my peacock habitat. If you would guys, if you guys would like a speed build for a peacock habitat or any others, again, just let me know. Uh, I think at this point I kind of forgot I was recording. Um, actually, I'm not sure if I did. But anyways, around here... Yeah, I just, I guess, I don't think I forgot I was recording. What was it? Oh, hmm. What is it? The glass? What? Do you see that? I don't, hmm. I'm gonna have to go back and fix that. I don't think I ended up fixing that. But there is, like, a wrong-sided glass. Hmm. I don't know how I did that. Now we're going to check out their stats. They're not very happy yet, so we're going to see what they need and more and less of. And we're going to go ahead and start doing that. Um, yes, this did actually take a while to get the amount of soil they wanted. Just saying. Um, there was way too much grass. Even though I started off with the biggest thing I could do, it took a very long time. So if you, again, don't want to see me putting down the dirt and short grass or whatever actually no we need less let me see if i can zoom in i'm not sure if i can looks like we need l more soil and less short grass currently um sorry the audio isn't great for these recordings um i'm on my phone because that's where i do most of this as you can see made with kind master hint hint um also, I used iMovies to speed this up because Kind Master, Kind Master, please, please add in a way to change the speed. Unfortunately, Kind Master doesn't have that. They have clip speed, but unfortunately, that's not good enough for videos. So, yeah, we had to figure that out, and it took quite a while. So, I really hope you guys enjoy this because that was not easy. Um... Looks like we're adding in some more soil, yeah. You can see, like I said, I don't know why I'm clicked on, like, you think that's a peacock there? Hmm. Not quite sure. But we're gonna give ourselves a bunch of dirt. I thought they liked some grass, but apparently they really need this whole thing to be covered in soil. Um, so, yeah. That is something which happened. I do like how I got the plants in this habitat later on. Are they happy with their thing now? No, they still want more or less short grass, I think is that what that is. Um, sorry, I might have to cut this recording in two parts because we're currently actually going to probably get ready to go for a pokey drive soon. But luckily, I think Kindmaster is smart at least and um, made it so you can start and stop recording. So that might be something which is happening. Um, if you see a little break, just know that that's what happened if I don't mention it, if I forget. Anyways, how have I been talking for eight minutes and I don't need water yet? <laughs> ay ay ay. I think that I probably made the, um, rocks not even enough, so I might go back and change that later on. Um, there will be as normal, or well, this will be normal, this is my first, like, speed build video. But it's going to be pretty normal um, from now on to start um, doing for our speed builds like a little aerial view. Um, if you guys don't know how to do that, you push G, I believe. Or that's at least how I do it. Um, 
I just think I'm putting more short grass down. Am I? Uh. What am I doing? I'm not sure what I'm doing anymore. Uh, I can't see that. I think I'm putting down, yeah, short grass. Hmm. I think I put down a bit too much. I think they're probably going to get unhappy. But we're looking for all of that long grass because they do not like the long grass. So we're just kind of looking around everywhere we can trying to get rid of all of it. And um, I believe it worked after a couple times through. Uh, it got most of the short grass. But it did take a minute or two. Got all of it in there and under the rocks, hopefully. I think I did. Uh-oh, now there's, I think, need more grass? Or... I can't quite see because I'm on my phone and it's so tiny. But you guys will be able to see since you guys will have full screen. So you'll have to let me know what I'm doing right now. Um... Okay, so I've gotten a couple questions on some of the past videos asking how to get money in franchise mode and here's what i do i start off small um so the first you know year or two is normally pretty rough we just want to get to central buildings and i hope i fixed that rock i don't know if i did <laughs> um but we want to start off pretty slow um because if you go too fast it starts to become too low on money and you can't fix stuff when stuff happens um, like when you need to get more staff or stuff. The other thing which is really, really useful is donation boxes. They give you millions and thousands of dollars. They are so useful. I'm not sure if I ended up putting them down in this suit because this is sandbox. But um, that's, I know, something that I did do in my franchise Zeus. Franchise mode is one of my favorite modes, um, but I do like cha challenge and sandbox as well. I'm not a big fan of career, though. Uh, you can see that. I'm not, I'm not sure if I even noticed that glass. But see by the door there, you can see the, um, the, like, little way how it, like, turned upside down thingy. Eh, I hope you see that. Looks like we got the train right. They need plants and coverage. Enrichment. And, uh, is that hard shelter? Maybe? I'm not sure. I hope this is, I hope that you guys enjoy, um, these videos. Um, cause, yeah, they take a while to make. And, um, yeah, I just want to make sure that people actually enjoy them. And, yeah, I don't really want to be making videos which no one wants to watch. So please, please give me that support. Um, yeah. Pretty boring time right now. Just trying to do what I can to get a little social life in um, YouTube. So, yeah, I haven't been doing this very long. Just to, what is it, maybe started in May or June or something? So it's been maybe two, three, three-ish months maybe? I don't know, I'm not even doing the math. <laughs> um, just so you know. Um, so we're starting to put down some trees. I did start off with palm trees, which I don't think I ended up, um, deleting. Which I probably should delete. I'm not a big fan of them in the Okapi habitat. Um, but it will start to look better as we get to more plants. So, yeah, cause that's way too many in that little area. Actually, that's a huge area. But, still. I do believe that I did put plants all along the edge like that, and that just kind of gives it more of a natural look, is like a natural barrier, um, helps if the barrier breaks, the animals can't escape as easily, it's just kind of, just kind of nice, and I like how it looks mostly though. So we're just kind of moving all of the little stuff and deleting it. What are we going to add in now? Um, different sizes of that, I believe, is what that is. And if you don't want to see decorating, you can, um, end the video around now, because for, for the rest of the video, I do believe it's going to be decorating. 
for the next uh, seven or so minutes, six or seven minutes. Um, but yes, for people who are going to go, I hope you enjoyed. Because I do know some people who like to, um, have the, just like habitat walls and stuff and how they like to do that. And then they aren't, don't really like watching how people do the interior because that's the part they enjoy. Um, like I said in earlier, I'm new to this, so, uh, sorry if it gets a little, little bit, um, distracting or something at some point. Anyways, I think I'm going to start this audio recording again in a minute or two because I actually need to go on that pokey drive. So I will see you guys all in like two seconds, but actually more like 20 minutes. So bye. Okay, guys, I am back. Sorry about that. So this is just kind of like a little tour of the area. You can see there's a bunch of toys and bedding areas and trees everywhere. And there's lots of logs for them to climb on, though I don't think Okapi climb. Uh, So anyway, subscribe and bye!